In this video, I'll show you how to import the data into Zamovi. So before uh, let me begin the session, I just want to show you something from Zamovi website. So if you want to download the software, you just type Zamovi in Google, you'll be able to locate this link. So if you go to this page, you can click download and then uh, you can download the current version. Um, so uh, and again you have user guide and then there are certain uh, uh, resources are available here so this is completely free to the public anybody can make use of this particular software this is also exactly similar to that software and here when you want to use certain menus you just go to this modules and then click Zamovi library so whatever may be the libraries available in Zamovi software you will be able to locate it for example, in terms of creating the scatter plot and other things, you have a package called scatter. Similarly, for R editor, you have a package. If you want to do the R programming within the Zamovi framework, you can install this. Similarly, uh, you have power analysis and then even for SEM also, you have this is structural equation models based on Lavan. So even SEM can be done with the help of uh, Zamovi. I'm, I'm just... Uh, installing this this is the way how you can install it some of the advanced mediation models can be tested here including multiple mediation and then uh, conditional process analysis that can be done here so for that again you just click this install so your uh, particular library will be installed here here you have another uh, uh, package on simple mediation and moderation analysis you can also install this for fx size you have a package for survey plots you have a package for path analysis also you have a package so whatever may be the packages you want you want to install it you just uh, select that package and then click install that will be installed in your machine so this is a way how you can locate the appropriate library for your data analysis as well as you can install the required packages it may take some time ensure that you have proper internet connection uh, when you uh, import the packages some I mean, respective packages to your local drive um for example now let me show you how to do the basic analysis using zamovi um, before that let me install this path analysis and then uh, let me install this advanced mediation models sem is already installed so once you install something here you will be able to see the um I mean options for example sim can be done with the help of interactive menus that is also possible same thing can be done with the help of syntax menu that is also possible so now what I'm going to do is uh, let me show you how to import the data you just select this three horizontal lines and then click open and then you try to click browse so my data set is available in desktop so this is the data I'm going to import click open your data set will be imported to your Zamovi software now if you want to do some frequencies you just go to frequencies sorry you go to this exploration and then click this descriptives so now I'm trying to do some descriptives here um, so if you want to do the descriptives for age you just include it here and then I have some of the variable scores work family balance JS that is job satisfaction family satisfaction and the life satisfaction you just include them here and if you need the frequency tables for all of these variables you can select this frequency tables mainly this frequency tables are utilized only for the categorical variables or ordinal type of measures so that's the reason we are not getting the output here so when you want to um, ask the system to produce some more details like skewness cortices you just select this statistics and then select skewness cortices and then uh, univariate normality test can be done by checking this particular option and uh, even you, you can also create histogram density plot uh, and then bar plot for some other quantity variables that is available in your uh, analysis so this is a way how you can also make use of different plots that is coming under this descriptive statistics umbrella um, now let me show you one more thing just go to the descriptives here instead of uh, metric data points I'm going to include gender 
and then you just click frequency tables this is how you will be able to get the frequency tables so for categorical and then ordinal data types you can run this frequency analysis for rest of the metric data points you can use any i mean you can perform any of the descriptive statistics that is measures of central tendency and then measures of distribution can be applied but in the case of nominal type of data maximum you can do frequency analysis and mode so here you can also compute this mode also so here you will be able to get the mode basically two is uh, repeated uh, quite a bit of time so since i have only two categories here so it doesn't make any sense to me in terms of identifying this mode value so this is a way how you can run the basic analysis that is descriptive statistics and frequency analysis using zamovi software thanks for watching this video